I am Groot. Hello guys. It is Dan back with an unboxing for you guys. Um this just came today. It was supposed to get yesterday, but I got today. It's kinda late. It's like one AM here. Long day for me. Just got back from C two E two. Pretty good con. Crowded, but pretty good con. But I got this today. I figured I unbox it for you guys. Um should be good. I'm hoping. I have no idea what's in it. They didn't release a teaser or anything, at least that I saw. But it's Guardians of the Galaxy Volume 2 themed. So, it's bound to be pretty good. If it's anything like the movie. Movies, I should say. Um, it sounds like the pin is loose. So it might fall out when I open this, but we'll see what happens. But yeah. I'm hoping there's a good pop in here, good shirt. Let's just get right into it. So from the start we have the pin, which was loose. Looks like, what's her face? Yeah, it's Gamora. Oh, I gotta get my trusty light out. Oh man, that's bad. You can kind of see it there. So there's Gamora. Oops. Pretty good start. And the pin. Ooh, the pin's nice. And not the pin, the patch is nice. It's uh, Star Lord. If he will come out. Okay. Bam. Very nice. I'll definitely put that on something. Just not sure what. So we're off to a good start. I'm going to put the box over here so I get kind of like a blind. Is this still recording? Yeah, okay. So I get like the blind um, thing. I'm not looking into it or anything. So I feel a comic from the start. Okay, that's next month. I don't want to look at that. So, Collector Core, I think it's exclusive, variant, secret, so, I think it's a Captain America thing, because the Hail Hydra thing's in that star there, I see a skull, yeah, try to get closer, it's real, but yeah, you can see a skull in the middle of the shield. So I think it might have something to do with Captain as well as the Guardians in that. So that's pretty cool. Um, this feels like a shirt. So save that. This feels like a pop. What's in here? Oh, it's not a pop. It's a Dorbs. It's exclusive. It's um, Star-Lord with the Milano. What is the Milano? I don't know what the Milano is with this recording. There it goes. It's, uh, looks like a spaceship, basically. Or a motorcraft of some sort. I guess I'll see it with the movie. So that's cool. Um, okay, here's a pop. Pop Funko is Rocket with Groot, which I very much like. I probably will open this. Um, so you got Rocket right on top of, damn it. I'm sorry, I guess I'm not used to this dark light thing. That's pretty cool. That's a good pop. So you got Groot just riding on Rocket. I like that. So that I don't really like the Dorbs thing, though, to be honest. But let's see what's left. I think just the shirt. Let me look inside, see if there's anything else. No. Just a box that expands into what looks like Groot. You know, all of them actually. We'll do a recap. Ugh. How does it look, guys? Honestly, oh, it looks dark. I can't. <laughs> Oh, that's cool. I like that actually. 
So it's pop version of all of them. Which looks pretty nice. That's a good shirt. I do like that shirt. Can't really see it because my lighting sucks, but. Good shirt. I'd definitely wear that. I kind of wish though Star Lord had the mask on in this shirt. That's the only thing I don't like about it, really. But other than that, this is a decent box. Um, let's see the recap. So we got. Yeah, the only thing I really didn't like, I guess, would be the Dorbs. But I really like the patch. And uh, next Marvel will be Spider Man Homecoming. I'm not sure if I'm going to stay signed up for it. We'll see what happens. Um, that'll be after another convention I go to, so I probably won't have that much money. So, we'll see if I say signed up. But until uh, my next box, everyone take it easy, uh, be safe, all that, all that good stuff. And uh, yeah, check you later. Peace out.